hello and welcome this is deepak mishra and here today i am going to talk to you about a scam like material that is going around in the internet now i say scam like because nobody has come to me as a victim of the scam but many people have come to us as seeking opinion about this thing that is it doable is it workable uh, about the fees that uh, certain people are charging so i am no activist okay it is not my idea to expose all the scams that are going around in society and in the in the world okay it's not my job it's not my work i focus on my job that is being a surgeon i focus on my work that is spreading information i focus on helping the clients who are enrolled with our consulting company and enrolled in our roadmap courses and people other people who are there on facebook group for example i share my information as i get updates as i get uh, as and when i have time i answer those questions but it, i don't take it upon myself to review everything and to spread awareness about like the wrong things that are going on or the false information that is going on because that itself would be a full time job but this piece of information or this photo that i received in an email that could not be overlooked that is if there is minor mistake so there is a change of opinion change of strategy it's understandable but if there is totally something very absurd then uh, i could not ignore the urge to create a video about that all right for that reason this video please bear with me don't start uh, putting your hate comments that i also run a consultancy company that is the reason why i'm doing this i'm not doing it because of that i have taken name out of the name of the consultancy company or all the, the every, everyone involved in this thing i am just posting the material that has been shared and uh, i will we will go through it together okay now let us see in if you are someone who knows about the process okay uh, who is in the process or who is already a doctor in germany you might uh, understand or recognize the flaws in this okay please write in comment section what do you think about that and let's let's see it step by step happy news for fmge not cleared medical graduates now unfortunately this is a predatory kind of advertising for people who have unfortunately not passed the fmge exam step 1 it says is that study german language till b1 and get certified no problem okay you know german language is compulsory for getting into pg in germany or working as a doctor in germany so you have to get a language certificate to b1 get certified fine clear the interview and get the offer letter that is a step 2 now what for what is this interview and for what kind of offer letter it is what will the offer for what step 3 is that here gets little clear step 3 is that study one year medical assistant program with stipend now the medical assistant is not nothing to do with medicine okay it's a nursing basically a assistant of the nurse as a name is a medical assistant but it is a 3 years program or somebody who is already a doctor could produce documents it can be reduced okay so it can be uh, true that it can be done in one year that is okay acceptable and there Uh, the stipend of say one thousand euro is also okay. It's also clear. It's right. One year program. Till then, it's okay. It's for somebody. Now we are going in direction that somebody who is a doctor wants to become a medical assistant. That is going to become basically a nurse kind of job. For that restung uh, that direction we are going. But it's still okay. It's nothing wrong in that. Somebody wants to take that route. One can do that. After that, on completion. get certified and work minimum for one year on completion that means you complete one year of medical assistant job like the learning medical assistant the aus ausbildung and then you work for one year for as a medical assistant one can work the salary the minimum for one year and salary you will get is a 80000 to 1 lakh now in this photo you will see in step 3 it says in euros and in st step 4 it says the almost same amount in rupees Now I don't understand why would the almost same amount as a ausbildender, okay, as a azubi, that means as a student, and the same amount as a working professional. That does not seem correct, okay. Person would earn more because if you are earning say eighty thousand rupees or one lakh rupees in Germany, 
then you are living as a student hand to mouth situation because the blocked account according to the government 950 euro something 942 952 something some euro it keeps changing every few months that is the minimum amount that a single student requires for his monthly sustenance that means if you're earning only 80000 or 1 lakh that means you're just barely surviving living in a hostel somewhere and barely surviving that's not too much money because expenses are so high then now now comes the tricky part and important part step 5 start with recognition process after one year now this point you can start with recognition process okay degree certificate with transcript internship certificate now for person who have not cleared fmg exam how will you get your internship certificate because internship in india is after passing the fmg exam so in that case the step 5 you'll not be able to do degree certificate you would have transcript you would have so you cannot start you will not have internship so how will you start the recognition process now that is the point of contention and after that it says after recognition you can do fsp and move to medical doctor category not to this is after recognition yes definitely everybody knows that after recognition you can move on that path but that is the point that here you don't have the internship you don't have the license they have not talked about any license here that is wrong you need to have uh, in this case if the house building this uh, uh, medical assistant thing it does not add any credibility it does not add any advantage in your cv it is not like that that somebody who is not a doctor in germany uh, in in india for example comes to uh, germany does a medical assistant not even one year just say entire 3 years and he can suddenly work as a doctor it is not like that so the document that is required is required so the medical assistant job or ausbildung or training does not replace the requirement for the internship the requirement for your medical license requirement of your completion of medical training the entire thing what one has to understand is what german authority wants is that have you completed your medical training now one has to understand that completion of medical training means your academic training your licensing exam and your internship so if you have licensing exam if you have have the license to practice in your com- country or any any country for that matter now i'm trying to simplify it here because somebody might start writing in the comment that okay study country a uh, home country all those complication about china and ukraine i have those complications in my mind and i'll make separate separate videos on those topics but for this reason for this video let's keep it little simple and say that one license so if you don't have those and you go on this route of doing a uh, medical assistant job and then you will earn 5 uh, 1000 euro per month and then you will realize after doing all of this that that will be your career you will be you will become a medical assistant okay so and you will earn that i'm not saying medical assistant is a uh, it's a good job i mean people uh, it's a basically like a nurse job okay so you earn you um, you earn okay you live an okay life uh, you live i mean you have you'll get your often health title and everything in germany uh, but you will not work as a doctor in germany that is what i want to say that just for for somebody who wants to come here study here has that uh, imagination and ideas that okay, i'll go to germany that this will find you will find lucrative this will find very interesting but you have to remember this will not lead to your career as a doctor in germany okay my job as i said is that i try to give out information that i receive which i find uh, useful and important and my opinion which i find uh is good for people who are watching the the videos okay you take it you leave it it's up to you many people who believe in what i say or what our company projects they enroll with our consultancy services they take into they go into a road map courses and many people who go into road map courses learn from that road map and then after four months five months after they pass the fsp they start consulting others like they charge money for that so they start the facebook groups and that is also fine 
that is also fine if you gain information for us and you share that information so far as you're doing correct job good job nothing wrong with that okay but this kind of absurd information when that comes then i could not stop myself from uh, wearing my uh, activist hat on this uh, kind of thing and creating this video i hope i don't uh, hurt any nerves here and if i do then it's okay i don't care bye bye